Hello Digital Monkey School students. Today I want to talk to you about using the transform tool. We're going to use transform tool to fix the perspective distortion around this picture. This is something that I do frequently. We're going to go to lasso select and we're going to choose polygonal lasso tool. Trace around part of our image that we want to fix like so. We need to use guides so that we know that our sides are straight make those guys by dragging them out drag it one more time something like this keep your original just so that you can compare the results later let's go to edit free transform pull on those corners but right now as you can see if i'm just pulling on it it pulls the entire side instead hold control and that will only pull a single corner. What I'm doing here is I am aligning the side of my picture with my grid. And I'm going to do the same thing on this side. That's looking pretty good. Process confirm button. At the moment, this is not square. And I know that this image is square. It's a little bit scaled on Y. I'm going to go to our rectangular selection. Go and choose a fixed ratio. One on one should give us square and make a square we're using our guide for that i want to use the bottom guide to the bottom of my selection i'm going to press control for that and that will allow me to move this and it's snapping i need to make a new selection i'm going to now hold alt to deselect an unwanted area of the picture and now i can go back to edit free transform and in this case i just want to pull this down you can just press enter and uh, there you have it. Last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to use created selection to trim my image. Image crop and crop my image by using this selection. Go ahead and save it as PNG. For that, we're going to go to file, export as a PNG. And I'm going to go ahead and say save. It will ask me the location where I wanted to place it. I'm going to keep it here. Press fine. Final. That's how you use free transform tool to fix perspective distortion. And also this is how you export the PNG files. I hope you learned something new today with just a monkey school and I will talk to you later.